Daddy's Junkyard, and today we're going to be doing Air Wars. Uh, episode 5. Yeah, but we are two weeks away from the crossover. Two weeks away. Now how Yeah. Now how we're gonna do that one is we're going to watch all four of them. At one time. At one time. Then do our review. So it's gonna be great. But uh it looks like uh Uh, Maggie and, uh, I'm drawing a blank on her name. Alex has broken up. Well, not finally. I mean, we knew, everybody who knows the backstory knew it was coming, but we still did not expect. Well, we didn't want to see it. But, so far, Monel's not returned. But they are working on getting the lead on the and the, right? Yeah, and the weird thing is they did not show anything about the pod. I know. But we th my opinion, I don't know. Could be Tyler's. Think there's gonna be a new love interest with Lena and uh, Jimmy. Jimmy. Or James. Jimmy. And there was no Martian Manhunter in this episode. Actually, they were talking. They mentioned them, but... No episode. Uh, and we saw that Rain can now deflect bullets. Yeah, she got shot. Just like, um, and it went right through her shirt and bounced off. But uh, she didn't notice it. And... Jimmy got shot, but... Mm, yeah, and this episode was uh, the guy trying to frame her with the... Edge. It was Edge. Yeah, of uh, the uh, lead poisoning kids. Yeah, because uh, last season, there was this big bomb that went off that uh, Lena created, and it went into the atmosphere, and uh, that's how Monel left Earth. But, um... Somehow, kids were getting lead poisoning. It was only for the Daxmites, and now, uh, okay, so, and then, um, after the bomb went off, the Daxmites had to leave. It had no effect on humans, out, so they didn't lie. But, um, somehow kids were falling, and lead poisoning, getting lead poisoned. But, uh, well, the town swimming pool, you know, there's supposed to be chlorine in the swimming pool, but instead of chlorine, they put like this special carbon chemical that... When it reacts to water, it looks like lead poisoning. It, it's lead. It becomes lead, basically. And you get poison from it, and... Uh, this one, uh, the guy who framed her said it was all her fault. La 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 la. That's well, pretty much the thing, the moral, I think, to this story was... Never try to frame someone. Well, no, not that. When you're in trouble, your friends we'll or family them. is there to help. Which is like real life. Don't need super powers to have your friends around. <laughs> So, uh, the next episode we'll be watching. Watch, and this is weird. This, 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 this weird. Doesn't it? Okay, we'll be watching Flash next. Oh, and also we'll be showing a, oh, what you call it? A trailer? Not a trailer. Uh, for Earth X. The big old picture for that. I'll let you do the intro. Yeah, okay, <laughs> we just done got watching The Flash. And, my and the demon dog is jumping on me. 
uh, Girls Night Out. It, it's a good episode with it's the Flash, but no Flash. Flash was killing, but uh, today's hero was Killer Frost. Yep, Caitlin was the hero for this episode. I think this. A drop, drop baby like. Who's this? Yeah. He, he, he was drunk. Barry was drunk most of the episode. I love chicken wings! But... Uh, and, um... <laughs> Caitlin, they all had a rest Caitlin is the bridesmaid now. No. No. Maid of Honor. Maid of Honor. That's right. Maid of Honor. So, uh, oh yeah, and they went to a strip club and Joe saw his future stepdaughter at the club. Stepdaughter. Stepdaughter. Well, future stepdaughter. They ain't got married yet. Okay, still, technically, it's stepdaughter. Because they're having a kid, right? That don't mean nothing. But, uh... I'm no, just be quiet. Yeah, this episode is really, really good. I really liked when they uh, got arrested. <laughs> Stop, everyone, I'm a cop. I'm friends. But also, Caitlin revealed to everybody about the Killer Frost thing, where the... She's able to change from Killer Frost to Caitlin. The cure didn't take all the way, so... But it allows her to become Killer Frost and Caitlin. Okay, next is DC Legends. Thank you, Moro! What? We finished Legends. There you go. What? We finished Legends. There you go. Bye. Ow! This was, uh, should have been, what? Last week's Halloween? Vampires yeah. and stuff? This, this... Episode 11, Le Legends is not Halloween at all. But, uh, Damien Dark's back. He, he was dead and he's alive now. And the new... Like him. He dead, alive. Dead, alive. Make up your mind. And the new villain... What? Mentor? Mentor? Mentor. Mentor. No. Something like that. He's oh, no. the way they're doing it is like what they did last season, Savitar, for the Flash. So uh, he even sounds like him. Yeah, he's got a what you call it, like Savitar had uh, someone to talk through. So uh, I don't know. This was. Pretty good, but I still think uh, Flash is still number one. And don't tell me yet. Oh, don't, okay. don't do it yet. Yeah, because we don't still right on what we still got Arrow to do. Right you on that. He dyed his hair in the middle before we even finished the uh, before we even watched the Legends, and it looks weird. I mean, I know I dyed my hair, but it kind of looks. You can't tell, but I dyed it red. So, uh... Okay, the next is Arrow. Oh, oh, nope. And then we're done. So, oh, see you in a few no, minutes. Move, move. Okay, everybody, we just got done watching the Arrow. This is an episode that they should do on Father's Day. Yeah. But it, somehow it's on November 10th. But we found out finally who Ventilante... Ventilante. Yes, we found out who he is. He is... Uh, uh, something. The Black Canary's <laughs> ex-partner. Both partner. That's why I said partner. Both kinds. But, um... Uh, so, yeah, it was... The FBI's getting closer and closer and closer. Um... 
It was a good episode. I think it could have been better. Yeah. I agree. So, um... Let's see, a lot of flashbacks about, uh, Slade and his son. Found out his son is a leader of this organization called the Jackals. I got that. I'm Eric Sunday. So, um. Uh, okay, let's uh, get to our. Ratings. Your ratings on which ones you thought. Tyler, who was your number four? My number four was Arrow. I have to agree. Number four is Arrow. Who is your number three? Supergirl. Really? Mm -hmm. I'm going to say Legends. Me? Um, I'm going to say Legends. No, because oh. you never even do it. Okay, so. Your number two. You won't be surprised at this. The Flash. Mine's Supergirl. My number one is Legends. My number one was The Flash. See, this is weird, because this is the first time ever Legends was number one. Ever. For, for you. Any, for anyone. I believe Legends was only second place. But, uh, uh, okay, um, uh, we're fixed on... The 27th, we are doing the crossover. It is a... Four-night event. A uh, two-night event. Two-night event. What we're going to do is we're going to watch all four at once. And then we're going to do the review. <laughs> so, let's see. It'll be Monday and Tuesday. So, hopefully Wednesday of that week. Well, no, Wednesday of that week, we'll probably be watching it. Uh, uh, I guess special upload time? It will probably be Thursday when it gets uploaded. So, special upload day? Yep. Great. So, uh, well. You know I'm oh, wrong. wait a minute. Uh, I'm fixing, after this, I'm going to be showing you uh, a, what you call it? Trailer? For, no, not a trailer. A picture for Crisis on... Earth X. So, you know how we roll? As an owl, don't care as close. Peace. I do. Please smash that like button, subscribe to the channel, click the notification bell, and do anything you can do to help the junkyard.